one of the most wonderful uh, people, speakers, Mashpiyam, Rebbe Avram Mordechem Malach. He says over a fabulous story, he was once looking for a ride. It was a torrential downpour, and he was caught in the rain without a car. And a minivan pulls up, so he figures it's to offer him a ride. So he's about to step in, and he sees inside a young man, there's a yid. He says, no, 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 I can't take you. You see this minivan, it's my brother-in-law's, I cannot take you. He said, so, so what did you stop for? Well, I wanted to fulfill the words, I feel badly for you, and I wanted you to know that I'm with you, I'm in pain, that you're drenched and soaking wet, but I can't tell you, it's, I can't take you. It's my shvagras, it's my brother-in-law's. That's what you stopped for? Aval, but yeah, I, 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 I can't take you. And he drives away. Two minutes later, he comes back. Rabbi Avramor Tchamalach is now thoroughly drenched. He figures the fellow had a change of heart. And he's about to get in. And the Yid says again, no, 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 I told you, it's my Schwager's minivan. It's my, no, I can't take you. But let me tell you why I came back. Because the Gemara says, Zochim Adam Shalei B'fon, if you could do a mitzvah for someone and a merit, even without their knowledge. Taking you is a big mitzvah, so maybe my brother-in-law would want it. But I thought to myself, that's only Bimois Hagish Chama, not Bimois Hagish Shamim. Because if it's sunny, imagine, the guy's giving a Gans a Sheer Klali, and he's getting drenched. Well, you see, if it's Bimois Chama and it's sunny, you'll come in and it won't damage his car. But since it's Bimois Hagish Shamim and you're drenching wet, it might damage his car. So that's not a schus, that's a merit, that's a choiv, and therefore I can't take you. Avol, but... He came back to give a whole taira. I can't take you. It's my brother-in-law's, and it's you know, it's You're going to ruin the car. Sorry, but I came to let you know I am thinking about you. Not two minutes later, after he leaves, a big suburban pulls up an expedition. There's a chasidish yid, another yid who sees Rabbi Vamort Chamach, and he says, "Rabbi Yid, kim taran, come on in." He says, are, are you sure? I'm, 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 I'm soaking, I'm drenched in wet. He says, it's not a problem. It's my brother-in-law's. Come on in. <laughs> if you want to have an excuse, you could come up with any excuse. I can't take you because of this, and it's my brother-in-law's, and it's raining, and it's sunny, and climate control, and global warming. Avol, ashemim anachnu. What we're guilty of is, avol. I believe that is the number one thing that stands in the way of becoming alois bahar people.